Well, hello Aquarius. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. If you are new, hello, I am Yasmin. If you have not already, please like and subscribe. All right, Aquarius, we're going to go ahead and get started with your love reading. This is going to be a love reading for you. Um, I've already done your general reading with money and all that other stuff. I posted that yesterday. Um, generally, it's like um, every other day. Okay, if you were wondering. So we're going to go ahead and get started with the reading. Let's come out. Let's see what comes out here for you with love. This is for Aquarius. Okay. Six of Cups. Ooh. King of Swords. I see you moving on. And you're ready. You're ready for something new. I see you releasing something. You are ready for something new. Mm -hmm. And whoever you're going to be dealing with in the future could possibly live at a distance here. I think you need time to heal um, from whatever it is that you were, mm, I guess, dealing with the person you were dealing with in the past. You, some of you still have feelings for someone in the past. For some of you, you do. Okay. This person may, for some of you, come in and want to work something out. Yes, that's true. Um, maybe even to get closure. But I see you're trying to detach. Okay. <laughs> you're trying to like completely detach and walk away from whatever this is or whatever this was, basically. So let's go ahead. We're going to get into the second row. We're going to clarify. This is going to be for Aquarius. Yeah, Ten of Wands. I'm going to put this back because too many came out. Yeah, you're dealing with your past. Whatever that was, was burdensome for you. You know, you may not be happy. You may not be happy that, um, you know, that you had to walk away from it, but it's a relief Six of Wands, there is going to be someone new coming in here. I feel like you're moving on and with a positive mindset, okay? Um, whoever you're going to be dealing with, you're going to really try to put your best foot forward in the love department. I love it, okay? <laughs> um, yeah, you're allowing any sadness that you have felt, you're allowing that to pass you. I love it. Yeah. So, you know, for some of you, this may not be the past that you think that I'm talking about. So there could have been a past person that you were with, but it could be a past person that you were interested in that you weren't with for some of you. Okay. But either way, there is someone coming in here that likes you a lot. And I also see that there's going to be recognition for the job that you do, whatever it is that's come down to your career. I know this is a love reading, but I have, I mean, just this sitting in your in the middle part of your reading is amazing. Um, getting recognition for what you do as far as work. But someone's coming in here who likes you. I see a lot of happiness here with the sun card. Okay, Aquarius. I see happiness here. This is for Aquarius. Wow, King and Queen of Cups. Someone is watching you. You could be watching someone. Hello. Okay. <laughs> so I, I see a match. I do see a match here. Um, soulmate energy. Yes. That's what it looks like. A soulmate connection. We're going to go ahead and clarify these cards. We're going to start with the Six of Cups here for Aquarius. Let's see what comes out. Six of Cups for Aquarius. of cups so you had two that came out yeah this is soulmate this is this is soulmate and then you had the ten of wands so this is letting me know the past i mean it was just too much drama maybe different people secrets different lovers that type of thing um but like i said before you know um you are going to be going into a new soulmate connection. This is not to say that the person that you were dealing with wasn't a soulmate as well. Someone that you knew from a past life. Um, but you're going into a new a new connection. For some of you, I do feel like this could be someone from the past wanting to get back up, up with you. Okay, I have to say that. King of Swords. Because it's here and it's a general reading. Hmm. 
So I feel like a lot of you could be dealing with someone, oh, someone so smart, Aquarius. You are really, really smart, okay? Um, success in business, some type of leadership skills where people can see you. Like I said, I have to say it because it's just sitting right here. Very um, masculine energy, so I will be talking to the divine masculines. Um, I do see a lot of success financially, especially if that's been a worry of yours. Now, as far as the those who are dealing with a divine masculine, there's someone coming in your life that gets a lot of attention, a lot of recognition for what they do. They're very, very smart, okay? But this is you as well, Aquarius. This is you as well. You could, you could end up meeting someone at work here with the Three of Pentacles. It could be around your job or something like that. Okay, someone that you may have your eye on. Some of you are going to be um, maybe meeting someone at a restaurant or at a gym. Okay, someone that you frequent a lot is what it looks like. Let's get the King of Cups for Aquarius. King of Cups. You're going to have more than one person that you are going to be dealing with, okay, in the future. You're going to have to decide who you want. Now, again, like I said before, this doesn't have to be anyone from your past. It's just you you are dating. You may start liking more than one person, unfortunately, and it kind of creeps up on you. Ten of Wands, but I see more than one person that you're going to be dating. Oh, wait, look, flipped over. Okay, maybe it didn't. Let's get the Ten of Wands for Aquarius. Yeah, so you were dealing with someone who was, maybe it was a part-time connection. Someone could have been in a connection with someone else. That's true. Um, I, I just feel like in general, there could have been ghosting involved because other people were around. Someone was not giving you as much attention. Someone who was mistreating you, okay? Let's get the Six of Wands. Yeah. You could have been feeling stuck on this person. And this is the reason why you're moving forward. Definitely. You have a decision to make about lovers. There's going to be two different people who are going to like you a lot. Two different ones. <laughs> ah, money is going to be so good. Ah, nine of Cups, a wish fulfillment. I see there's going to be some type of commitment I, as some type of commitment energy here. Someone who thinks very highly of you. Okay. Mm. So in general, for those who are in a connection right now, you're going to be walking away, going into a new connection. I forgot to talk about the ones who could be in a connection. Uh, King of Wands is always like a new person to me. You're walking away. Yeah, you're dealing with someone who's mistreating you, ignoring you. Uh, you know, the relationship feels dead. The relationship feels very icy. And you could be trying to figure out if you want to stay or not. That is what I'm seeing for those who are in a relationship. I do see that you're going to end up walking away from that, okay, and to someone new. But, yeah, for those who are about to meet someone new, it is amazing. Let's go ahead. We're going to get some cards here. We're going to see what Spirit wants you to know. Based on the oracles, this is for Aquarius. This is for Aquarius. Let's see what comes out here for Aquarius. Okay, some of the cards, one of the first cards that came out was hopeful. They are opening themselves to love. So I feel like this could be with anyone. You know, this could be with someone that you know or someone that, that's new. Of course, they're opening themselves up. You're dealing with someone who's a little guarded, who ca could have been hurt in the past, okay? Here it says, release. They When they set you free, they felt the sting of the absence. Don't let their silence fool you. Yeah, I feel like, you know, either you released them or they released you. But whatever this is, it does look like that someone is going to walk away here. That's what I see. Um, it says, on a pedestal, you're the queen of their heart. That's exactly what I saw with that um, empress. Someone who thinks very highly of you here. That's going to be in your life. That's in your life now or will be coming in your life or possibly coming back. Okay. Let's go ahead. Let's get this last card here for Aquarius. I love it. 
I see emotions though running high. So I mean, I mean, it's not saying this this is final, whatever this is. But I feel like like how one of it talks about that they released you or you walked away because they don't really want to open up. That is possible. It's easier for them to deal with other people and not really face their feelings. Here it says investigating. That's what we see with the page of sores. I see somebody watching. You guys could be watching each other. Last message here. Anxiously waiting for a phone call, for a message to or something like that. It says they search They search for you everywhere. Maybe you're not <laughs> posted on Instagram or social media as much. It says, um, it says feel you. It says they search for you in, in everything. Um, they feel you everywhere, always in the back of their mind, hoping that you were, you run back to them. So there is someone in your energy who energy here that really is in love with you, but I feel like you're trying to move forward, keep your options open. It may be even hard for you to even move forward. Um, uh, but it's going to be up to you because you, you have people here, you got multiple people here. So that's going to be up to you Aquarius. Okay. But I saw 1111, as soon as I looked over, this is some type of twin flame soulmate energy that you're going to be entering in. And then at the bottom of the deck, it is, look, I said twin flame. I do see it. And then you have building an empire. They see how their focus on material things hasn't made them happy. A lot of you, like I said, is they're dealing with someone is dealing with someone who is very popular, that type of thing. That's exactly what I said. Um, a lot of what they're doing is holding themselves back from how they really feel. Okay. And this is what some of you will experience. You have experienced, but this is what's here. Either way, Aquarius, this is what I have for you. Thank you so much for coming back to my channel. And again, if you are new, please like and subscribe, hit that notification bell, and I'll see you soon. Bye.